hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so today i'm sharing some beautiful mirrored home decor diys i'm starting off with a 12 inch round mirror as well as these mosaic tiles everything is from amazon i will have it listed down below I removed the tiles from the back mesh and I'm going to be using strong adhesive just to border around this mirror. And here's how it turned out. I've added felt pads to the bottom so that I can use this on any surface. And as you can see, this can be used as a tray or it would make a gorgeous charger plate in any tablescape. So let me know down below what are your thoughts on how this turned out. Twenty four inch beware sign I purchased during Halloween at Dollar Tree. They have different signs for different seasons, so they're always available. I'm going to be using four of the mirror strips from Amazon. I'm going to have that link down below as well and my strong adhesive. And I'm going to be gluing two of these mirror strips on either side of this sign. I've got some single strips of the rhinestone adhesive and I'll be adding these to the side of my mirror. Next, I'll be taking the mosaic tiles and I'll be adding that to the center of my design. And I'm gonna go ahead and fill the middle because there'll be a space at the top and bottom where I'm gonna be adding some more of the diamond strips. Now taking my strong adhesive, I'm going to be gluing these pieces down. I'm going to allow the glue to dry for a couple of hours before flipping it over and adding my hanging hook to the back of this piece and this is just from a Dollar Tree frame. Next, I'll be taking this Dollar Tree candle holder as well as this prism crystal that I purchased on Amazon. I'm going to be gluing that to the bottom of this candle holder. Thank you. 
Now I'm adding glue to the bottom of my wall decor and I'm going to set my candle holder into place. Using some tape, I'm gonna secure it so that it doesn't move while it dries. I've added some extra command strips to the back of this piece because it's quite heavy. So I wanna make sure that it is secure on the wall. And here's how it turned out. I think these came out absolutely gorgeous. But let me know down below, what are your thoughts on how these turned out? And if you'll be trying any of these DIYs for yourself. So that is all for today. I want to thank you so very much for watching. I truly appreciate it. I hope that you're doing well and I'll see you in the next one.